<laughs> I built this barn. When I moved here, there was just this one container. It's like a former semi truck trailer. No, oh, I see it now. Okay, okay, I get it. Without the wheels. You can still see the tail lights. I think there might even be a license plate on it. <laughs> so there was that one, but it's got a giant hole in the roof. So it's not very dry. All right. When I was moving here, I needed some place to put all my tools. So we got another container, this big red one. 40 footer, eight feet wide. And put it on the ground there. And so the idea was to build a barn over it, which would fix the hole in this roof. The red container gets unbearably hot in the summer because it's just like a big cake oven in the sun. So what I did is I poured concrete footings under both containers. You can see the corner ones Tears. there. Tears. And set those down to 12 foot space between the containers. And then each container is 8 feet wide. So the main roof is 28 feet wide. I think the and pigs are pointing out your piers here, right? Pigs, yeah. Okay, we got we got piers under the wood. Piers under the wood. And, th this, and then we've the, got piers underneath the actual under the container. Under the container there. Okay. So here, this is a you got a screen porch on here of some sort. <laughs> Our okay. uh, interns sleep in here in the summer. So intern we, storage, that's good. Yeah, intern storage. You gotta keep so those just, interns fresh. You gotta screen them in too, or the mosquitoes just haul them off. Yeah. You'll so. you'll lose calories that way. They'll they'll like turn into little intern raisins. Yeah. <laughs> Sucks them dry. Yep. Hi, pig. So, with the big roof, nine and twelve pitch. It's about eleven feet tall there in the middle. Upstairs. Wow. So that's, that's like my wood shop right now. It's not a very convenient place for a wood shop because you have to put all the wood upstairs and then bring stuff back downstairs. Don't build anything but it's big. What I, it's what I have right now that's under the roof. It does look dry. I mean, you're storing your hay in here. Yeah, it's dry. It has a big metal roof. If it so wasn't dry, that wouldn't be hay. That would be compost. Yes. Yeah, we tried that already. You tried making hay into compost? <laughs> yes. It's easy, isn't it? Works it? good. Yeah. yeah. Um, so right now, the hay lives in the middle. The cows. cows live on the side and in the back. Oh yeah, I see a cow-like thing over there. It looks kind of small though. That's yeah. yeah, Burger Buddy. Here, let's open and? the gate and go this way. Okay. Up, <sighs> ha, pig! Ha! You don't get to go in here. No pigs. Finally, I get to walk around without pigs nibbling at my toes. Alright, so this is one of the shipping containers here. Man, this is an old, rusty it's an old, yeah. piece of something or another. So we're storing stuff in there. If you like this sort of thing, come on out to the forums at permies.com where we talk about building stuff out of shipping containers, homesteading, and permaculture all the time. Main milker right That's now. That's the steamy mountain of manure.